of the new project. What have you been working on? I have been working on empathy. Giving out to the to the, the world. Interesting. Yeah. That's a weird it's what been Why like that? a decade. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> a decade. So what I've done is I volunteered at this shelter and I am fostering cats. And I've gotten my first one and I, I'm new at it. I have had a cat before. Have you ever had a cat? Uh yeah, kind of. Okay. So well this one weighs two point eight pounds. That's small. It's a little, yes. You want to see it? That's why I had to keep you outside because he was running around. Oh, where's he at? Huh? Yeah, I'll, I'll go I, see I've Kitty. only had him for about six, seven, eight, nine days. And that's so cool. There's somebody that's going to get him, but it's not quite yet. Come on with me. You ready? He's little. He's orange. Where's he at? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, he's so cute. He doesn't have a name yet. <laughs> We've been calling him Mr. No Name. Come on in. Oh, thank you. You, you go in. Yeah, he is just the most comfortable Now, my daughter has what's called a Maine Coon. Oh, those are huge. They, she paid $2,000 for that. Yeah. And the vet, uh, he had some shots yesterday. And the vet says that he's probably got some in him. The little points on the top of his ears and the covering on the ears, and but he has all his toes. Maine Coons often have more than the normal number of toes, but he looks like he's got something else in him. But it's the coat, how feeling, how soft he looks. How Feels? do I get this cat? Huh? How do I get this cat? <laughs> how do you get that cat? I don't know. <laughs> I would ask. I would ask and find out for you if you think you're interested. They, they yeah. had. I've actually been wanting a cat. Like, have you? Yeah, I actually like. My mom said that like I could get a cat in January. Aww. Well, your mom lied to you. What are you talking about? That's your cat. You're lying. No, it's your cat. That's what I'm talking to mother about. I've been holding on to him and loving him for the last week. It's yes, yours. Don't drop him. It's yes, yours. For the next 15 years. Oh my god. Yeah. This is happening. Oh my god. I'm sure you'll take good care of him. Have a seat. Merry Christmas, Isla. Have a seat. Thank you so much. It's a kitten. Oh, my God. We've been taking care of him. Yeah. Oh, my God. He had a little so owie cute. with his tail. The vet says that kittens this size often get caught in a door because they want to rush in. And that's probably what happened to him, but we don't know. We don't know, but uh, it looks like it's in good shape. We took him to the vet yesterday. Um, so you, so the um, Marlene, the flamingo lady here, this cat was not potty trained when we brought him over here. Yeah. So uh, she has potty trained him for you. Uh, got him litter box trained. We got a bunch of stuff for you. Uh, we dewormed it. Uh, she got, yeah. We're going to get some food a little bit later. Uh, but Merry Christmas, honey. Yeah. Thank you. You I are got welcome. You're a fancy little man. Ray is the one that initiated this, and all of a sudden the cat had to have it home, and that he asked me to help, and that's why you're helping me to to take care of business, and I'm I've helped you with your cat. Thank you. Please name him soon. We're tired of Mr. No Name. <laughs> yeah, we we named Mr. No Name, and um... look at you, look at you. You like to see the flies. That's why I asked you what you're gonna name the cat. You gotta figure here. out how to put him by a by a window. The main coons love to see the outside. He's going to be an inside cat. He doesn't need to have rabies shots. But there's a, the things that, that Ray's helped to figure out, you know, your contract with him to have to have Mr. No Name. Now, that is the good news. The bad news is you actually are moving a couch. <laughs> so. Yes. He's going to stay here while we do our deeds, and then you come back. And uh, Ray's got it figured out what to do after that. And, uh, yeah, he is just so cute. So I convinced Mom, I convinced Mom for the kitten. You're so welcome. And you know what? Mom is making this happen. This is like you're going to be talking to mom and thanking her, like with everything you got when you, after this, you're going to give her a call. You're okay? lucky he's cute. Mom said if he wasn't cute, he wasn't, she wasn't going to let you have it. They don't get any cuter. This guy is just amazing. He's so tiny. We've been giving him a very good food. He's so And fluffy. he has gained, well, like 2.8 pounds. It's not much. If I've written it all out, 
and this oops, this is where all your paperwork is going to go when you have like that vet bill vet visits things like that and he is uh, uh i think you're probably going to have him spayed so he has yes uh, does not need to be yep um, and in three weeks we have we have to make an appointment for three more weeks for uh, extra boosters yeah by the 24th it's written in here uh he needs to get those. so we're going to bring him back so what do you think isla it's really cute yeah merry christmas honey it's the best present ever you happy that's why mom was having us clean our room so much. Yeah, yeah sneaker. You, you listen into conversations too much. That's all I'm saying. He is just, I want to tell you for sure. Now, he's so tiny that the collar he's wearing mm -hmm. is as little as it can get. The way you check to see about the collar so he doesn't choke is two fingers underneath between the collar and the, you know, because he's going to grow. And the other thing is it has a breakaway collar so he can't hang himself. It'll break before it'll fall off. I mean, he'll fall off. So, oh my goodness. He's so cute. I so, mean, I have to tell you. You're going to have to tell us what the name is later, okay? Yeah, you think about it. It's so, we like, also need to. Mr. Sushi. Okay. So I, she picked out a collar because she thought she was going to get a 